Hello, uh, Trey Reckliff here in my studio in New Zealand. Uh, I've been making a series of Luminar quick tip videos to show you all my favorite features in this awesome tool. You know, this is way better than Lightroom. You can do so much more in this tool. You can still use Lightroom to like organize your files. You can round trip to Luminar. Uh, but here I want to show you something that's not often used. It's the color cast tool. All right. I'm going to use that in conjunction with the AI filter. All right. So this is uh, called Accent AI, and it's kind of like one of the secret sauces of, uh, of Luminar. And I use this on almost all my photos I run through Luminar. So I can just jam this up, and you can see it, it uh, just makes it more punchy, more contrasty, more colorful, very smart. Like it says, it's sort of an AI. Um, I don't know if it's actually AI. A little bit of a marketing spin there. But um, it does do different things based on the kind of photo you give it. Okay, so I think this is, you know, a slight improvement if we get the before and after, all right. Um, but this other tool I have been using quite a lot, it's called Remove Color Cast, okay, and it's especially useful at these times of day where all the light is filtered through um, a color, right. In this case, this is very early in the morning. This is here Lake Hayes, uh, right by my house. And we get these early morning uh, light that sometimes goes through these blue clouds. And it gives it sort of a blue color cast. All right. So here you can see as I increase the amount of it, right, if I take it up to 100, it, it's not so blue anymore, right? And, it, you know, it's your artistic decision, right? You're the artiste. You can do whatever you want to. Um, and sometimes you might like that kind of moody blueness, which I do kind of like. But if you want to get rid of it, be sure to go up here to the amount, right? And there's two different kinds of methods here. Uh, this, that's auto one, and then you can try auto two and move that up. So it does a little bit different kind of look. In this case, I think I like um, auto one a little bit better, okay? So there we go, there's a lot more sliders I could show you. I just want to focus on, on those two right now. So I'm gonna slide back and forth for a little before and after here, do this. See, just two quick sliders has made a tremendous difference on the photo, all right? Uh, be sure to check out some of my other videos. We've got one of my favorite filters in here is called the Sunrays filter, and it does some really cool stuff. Um, but you'll just have a ball using this tool. Um, I have a link to the other video um, and a link to Luminar down below. So be sure to check it out and uh, share your photos. We have a little Facebook group called the Becoming an Artist Facebook group. And uh, it's a very welcoming place. Come in there and share your photos and get all kinds of feedback and make some new friends. All right, guys, uh, love you and see you next time.